This is Catholic Daily Reflections for Thursday of the 14th week of Ordinary Time. Today's reflection is entitled, The Cost of the Gospel. Without cost you have received, without cost you are to give. What is the cost of the Gospel? Can we put a price on it? Interestingly, we should put two prices on it. The first price is how much it should cost us to receive it. The second price is how much we charge, so to speak, to give the gospel. So how much should the gospel cost us? The answer is that it's of infinite value. We could never afford it, monetarily speaking. The gospel is priceless. As far as how much we should charge to give the gospel to others, the answer is that it's free. We have no right to charge or expect anything so as to give away something that we do not own. The saving message of the gospel belongs to Christ and he offers it freely. Let's start with the second half of the scripture above. Without cost you are to give. This tells us that we are to offer the gospel to others free of charge. But this action of freely giving the gospel brings with it a sort of hidden requirement. The giving of the gospel requires that we give of ourselves. And that means we must give of ourselves freely. What's the justification for giving everything of ourselves freely? The justification is that we have received everything without cost. The simple fact is that the gospel is all about a total free gift to us, which requires a total free gift of ourselves to others. The gospel is a person, Jesus Christ, and when he comes and lives in us freely, we must then become a total and free gift to others. Reflect today on both your complete receptivity of the gospel as well as your complete willingness to give. May your understanding and reception of this glorious gift of God transform you into a gift for others. Let us pray. Lord, may my heart be open to you in a total way so that I may receive you as the living gospel. As I receive you, may I in turn give you to others in my very person. Jesus, I trust in you.